Today's video is sponsored by Theme. Theme. I am currently drinking a warm and cozy beverage made with dream powder to help me fall asleep. It tastes like a delicious nighttime hot chocolate and contains no added sugar. So you're telling me I can combat my usual night of tossing and turning with hot cocoa? Yeah, yeah, sounds good to me. <laughs> dream powder contains ingredients such as l thalanine magnesium, melatonin, nano-CBD, and reishi to help you fall asleep and stay asleep. That way, you wake up refreshed. It also comes in different flavors and potencies, so you can customize it for your lifestyle. Let's prep some together, shall we? Okay, so let's put together some dream hot chocolate, shall we? Um, the blend I have is cinnamon cocoa. Here is the bag. This one's 15 calories, but some of the others are only five. Okay, I have heated up my lactate milk. Sometimes I use water, but today I'm using milk because, you know, I'm just like feeling going all out today. Then I'm going to add one scoop scoop. And I'm going to use this beam frother that I believe is part of the deal if you use my code AmyK. But we'll get into that later. And now I'm just gonna froth the heck out of this thing. All right, now that we are well frothed, let's take a sippy sip. In my opinion, the powder itself smells like chocolate cake, and this itself tastes like chocolate cake with a little hint of cinnamon. It's delicious and cozy. So personally, I have found that I sleep very hard after drinking um, some dream powder, but also, ironically, my dreams are very vivid. Like, I have more dreams than I normally do, which is something I didn't really expect. Really cool. You can use my code AmyK to get 35% off your first order when you subscribe, and then 20% off all the following orders. Plus, when you subscribe to dream powder, you will receive a frother with your first order. You can pause, skip, or cancel at any time, so there's no risks. And with that, thank you so much to Beam for sponsoring this video, and let's get on to it. Hey bestie, I'm so excited to see you. I've been waiting to hang out with you all day. Well, yeah, well, I am bestie Barbie, so while you're off at work, all I do is wait for you to get home so that we can hang out. But now you're here. So, tell me, how was your day? How was work? Mm hmm Wow, that's great! You are always so good at what you do. Mm -hmm. So jealous. Your hair is so pretty today. Did you do this? Where you dyed it the two different colors? Wow, you're so trendy. I'm so lucky I have you to help me stay up with like all the trends and things. <laughs> oh goodness. So long. Your hammers grow so fast. And this side as well. Just as silky. <laughs> so, I wanted to let you know that I brought you your favorite snack. Mm -hmm. You mentioned you were a little famished, but you also weren't hungry enough for a full meal. So, you said no for the pizza, which is totally fine. We could do that later when we're watching movies and having fun and all that stuff. Okay, let me grab those snacks for you. So, I decided to grab you the toasty, 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 toasty peanut butter crackers because I know that you love these crackers filled with peanut butter and that you've been snacking down on them since middle school. That's so cool of you to just know what you like and then eat it from middle school until now. That's really cool. You're honestly the most intriguing person I've ever met. Almost everything about you is like, whoa, that's insane. They could be a part of a movie. I would totally watch a movie about your life. Yeah, it'd be like an inspiring one. Something about like 
an adventure through life, getting to know yourself, I don't know, just like breaking the boundaries of being awesome and fantastic. Absolutely. Oh, so here you are. Okay, next. I know you might be getting a little tired of it, but I can't help myself. I've made you another friendship necklace. And if you don't like this color, I can make you a whole other color. Just let me know. I mean, I have all day to do it, so here I have this one. So if you want one that's like a different fruit, like maybe an orange or a blueberry, I can do that too. But I just thought flowers, because I think that you smell like a bouquet of flowers. And not even like with perfume, you just smell really good. Yeah, not a lot of people have that trait. Yeah. So, flowers for you. And I think I'm getting better. See, look at that craftsmanship. So here's that for you. I hope you like it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to brush your hair while you tell me a little bit more about your day at work. So, you mentioned you did an amazing job like usual, had some really great ideas and things. What else happened? Oh, you had a quarterly review? That's so exciting. I bet you got stellar reviews. <laughs> oh, really? Your boss only gave you four out of five stars? Why is that? Everything that you do is fantastic. They must have... Are they bullying you? They can not see your true potential? They're not appreciating you like they should. That's what's really going on here. If you like, I could get back at them. Do you want me to slash your boss's tires? I'll do it. I'll slash their tires. Well, they would deserve it. You're kinder than me. It just gets me so fired up when people don't appreciate you like I do. Oh, I mean, just a little, tiny little thing. I could just shake them up a bit. I know I can. Be real intimidating. You appreciate them! No? Alright, well, if you change your mind, let me know. I'm always ready to, you know, do what I need to for you. Just like with Rebecca. <laughs> oh, you know, Rebecca. Your friend? Well, I don't know if I'd call her your friend. You know, when she made that comment recently, well, you took some scissors to your hair, and it was a mistake. Sometimes we make mistakes and it didn't turn out the way you wanted it to. You still rocked it and pulled it off, by the way. But then in front of everyone, she alluded to the fact that you should probably wear a wig until it wears off or grows out. How absolutely so embarrassing. Ridiculous. Well, anyway, so after that, I decided to sneak into her house and put rat poison into her shampoo. And now she wears a wig 24-7 because all her hair fell out. Well, she deserved it. <laughs> Once again, you're so much nicer than me. <laughs> but, like I said, she deserved it. Okay, let's do some skincare, shall we? You look absolutely gorgeous. Your skin is flawless and amazing, but it doesn't help to hydrate now and again. Not that you could use it or anything, but it will feel nice. <laughs> okay. Just going to put a little bit on my hands here. Perfect. It smells amazing. Here. Smell. Smell. That smells amazing, right? Okay, now I'm just gonna massage it into your face, alright? Hold still. Good. I'm glad. I just want 
wash away any stresses that you've had today to really let go and relax just work all those tensions out of your face here around your eyes work all that too. There we go. Don't forget to unclench your jaw, bestie. I know sometimes it's very difficult and we don't even realize that we're doing it. Let go of all that stress and just melt away. work it in just a little bit more. Okay, so I have this thing and I know I use it a lot, but I really like the sound. And but you also really like it too. Like it's very massagey and relaxing on your face, right? Okay. See? We like so many of the same things. It's like we're meant to be best friends. Awesome. Okay. Once again, I'm asking you to just relax as I pamper you, okay? Ready? or something like that, which you have amazing calves. Like most people have to go to gym, like the gym to get calves like that. I think that even like workout party doesn't have the calves that you have and you don't even really work out. She is super jealous I bet. I feel like a lot of people are probably really jealous of you. <laughs> probably also really jealous of me for being your bestie too. I know I would be if I wasn't. Okay, let's continue a little bit more. Maybe we're getting in. Mm, that looks good. Let's move on. Okay. Since it's been really hot today, I was thinking that this cooling eye mask that I have had in the fridge all day, that we could put it on your face, okay? And then it'll just really cool and soothe your eyes. All right. Ready? I'm going to place it on your face. Okay. All right, there. Now, isn't it just so cool and nice on your face? It feels amazing. I'm so glad. Okay, so it doesn't stay cold for long because your face will warm it up and then I'll take it off. But until then, I'm just gonna massage it into your face because that's gonna feel really nice. Doesn't it feel really nice? I'm glad. You are just the nicest person to me. You really are super fantastic. I just couldn't imagine being besties with anyone else. You just treat me so well. You're always telling me how pretty I am and how smart I am and how lucky you are. No one's ever been that nice to me before. It just really shows how big your heart is. And I'm just so lucky to have you. Okay. Just gonna get 
continue to work it in there. Are you feeling a little bit better? Even though someone who shall not be named was not quite so nice to you today. Oh, I'm glad. should be good. And, um, is it still cool or is it starting to get warm now? It's starting to get warm. Okay, I'm just gonna take it off of you, okay? Alright. It's so cool to play with. I like how blue and sparkly it is. I like things that sparkle. And I really like that we could have different aesthetics. And you're still always so nice to me about it. I think we complement each other well. Right, let's put this away. Next, let's go more into the hair, shall we? I really enjoy straightening your hair. It's so much fun. Even though it has just this perfect natural curl to it. You know, like a wave that just sits so nicely. Do you do your hair in the mornings? Barely? Oh. It's hard to tell. It looks professional, in my opinion. <laughs> Here, I'm just gonna straighten it a little bit. For funsies. So tell me. So you think I'd really like it? Oh, okay. What about any songs lately? <gasps> I've heard that one. It's so cool, right? It's one of my favorites. You have just the best taste in music. I'm pretty sure like all my music recommendations are from you. They're always good, so why ask anyone else? <laughs> okay, just a little bit more here. It's on a low heat, so you have to go over it quite a few times in order to get it right. do another strand. Alright, I'm thinking this one here. Is that bird outside your window causing you any trouble? I noticed it's very vocal. If you want, I can take care of it for you. Oh goodness, no, I would never hurt it. Just run outside screaming at the top of my lungs, get out of here, get out of here, bird. And then every time it showed up and started being vocal and chirping away, I would yell right back at it. Chirp, 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 chirp. Yeah, just give it a little bit of its own medicine, basically. I can do that for you. Even if it's in the middle of the night, you can text me and then I'll rush over and I'll just chirp, 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 yell at it until it decides to fly away. And then, you won't have that nasty bird keeping you up all night. You need your beauty rest. Absolutely. Well, not that you need it. You're already so gorgeous. But everybody needs sleep to stay healthy. Okay, that should be good. Let's move on, shall we?
Now I know I mentioned that you smell like a bouquet of flowers in the wind and to be honest, I think you also smell like a fantastical dream if that was ever a scent <laughs> but this smells really good too and I think it would just mix with your your base, you know, your normal scent and it would just elevate it everyone's gonna be turning their head like whoa, that is crazy, that person smells like a dream in a fantasy movie, if it was real but with flowers and whatever her scent is on top of it <laughs> okay, ready? Yay! <laughs> just going to make sure that it gets all over you, I know it's sort of Mist it into the air here. There, just make sure that it gets there. Mm, it smells so good. Okay, I thought it would just be the coolest thing ever if we had matching pens. What do you think? I'd love to be matchy matchy with you, and <laughs> you could have, well, whatever color you like. And then people would be like, look at those two besties, they have matching pens. Isn't that the coolest thing ever? Yes, it's the coolest thing ever. So, which color would you like? Would you like this purple one? This is like a baby pink. This one is a peachy pink. And of course, blue. <laughs> what are we thinking? Blue? Okay. Then, which one do you think I should have? I just, I trust your opinion more than mine. <laughs> which one do you think's best for me? You're right, the pink one, the, the peachy pink one is pretty perfect for me. So, I'll set these over here and I'll wrap that up for you. Okay, so I also have these stickers as well. I got these little hearts here. Isn't that just the cutest little thing? It's a froggy. And oop, my hair. These little flowers do. I couldn't resist. I was like, those would be perfect. So I got this cute little pot. And it came with stickers. And I was looking at some of these and I thought Bestie would love these. You can have any one of them that you would like. So first there's this little cow, pink cow. I think this one might be my favorite even though all of them are so good. And then there's this little pink puffer wearing a froggy poncho. And then there's a hedgehog with a peach. A bee. He's pretty big, isn't he? His wings are pretty tiny. I don't think he should be able to fly, but... <laughs> and then there's a little pudgy frog with tiny little legs. And a little squirrely. Or is it a chipmunk? I'm not really sure. And we have a frog on a rainbow. And another little tiny frog. A caterpillar. A little snail. And a frog in a stump. And a stump and a stump. So which one? Which one do you think you would like? And I'll save it for you. You can have more than one. Yeah. I think that frog one is so cute and very you. You can put it on your notebook. And if you want, you could even put it on the back of your phone case. I know you like to put stickers on there. And which other one? The pupper. Yes, that one is so cute. Okay, I'll set these aside. And if you decide that you want more, just let me know. <laughs> Alright, I know this is selfish of me, but can I do your makeup, please? I just love doing makeup on your face. It never looks right on me. Plus, it's so much fun to pamper you and, you know, just make your makeup all pretty and stuff. 
Is that okay? Oh, I'm glad. Okay. Let's start with a little something on your eyes. Okay, let's put some... Eyeshadow on. So, I'm thinking we start with a darker shade. So, let's go with this brown. And I'm going to put it on the creases here. Okay. And on this crease here. Okay, and let's do your main color as this blue. And get this will get all over the lid. Here we go. All over the lid here. Mm, just a little bit more on this side. And even it out. And I'm gonna do one last shade in the inner crease. This is a lighter shade. That way it'll help your eyes pop and sparkle. Okay, just carefully, just a little bit. There we go, and just a little bit, a little bit, a little bit on the inner corners there. Good. Oh my gosh, it's looking amazing. Let's move on. Eyeliner next, of course. I'm just going to do a very simple smudge on the outside here. And then I'll smudge it with my finger so it does this, like, perfect smoky eye for you. But it's not super smoky. It's only subtly smoky. Okay, ready? looks perfect. Can't forget the mascara. Okay. Ready? Okay. All right. And okay. Once more. side. And the lower lashes. Can't have too much product. I wish I wish I wish I looked as magical as you. <laughs> so I have this blush for you. And I'm just going to make sure I get enough on the pad here. And on the other side, of course. smiling all day, which you have. <laughs> and on the other side. It's so cute. A little bit on the nose too though. I like to even it out that way. Yes. Okay, almost 
almost done, I promise. And then I'll let you just relax and take a nap because you deserve it. Or maybe you'd like to have some you time to just be by yourself and de-stress and just mm, take a load off that day. Some lip gloss. Okay, ready? really all that I had planned for us tonight. Um, if you want to, we can watch that show that you recommended me. Um, I don't know if you'd want to re-watch it or something. But also, we could pick out a movie to watch. I know that there's some really cool ones out. Um, but we could also look into the old movies you have, like all the DVDs, and that way we could really support all the actors during their strike. Just watching some old stuff and not giving our money to those streaming services until they pay the actors correctly, right? And writers, too. <laughs> oh, you know what? There are some really cool Disney movies that I haven't seen in a long time. And mm, I have a lot of favorites. I just haven't looked at my collection in a while. But I know we're gonna find something. <gasps> the old Spider-Man. <gasps> the one with the yes. Mm -hmm. I like to think of him as the original Spider-Man. But that's not even true. It's just because it's the first Spider-Man movie. The one, the director, Raimi? Yeah, yeah, exactly. With Tobey Maguire. That's totally what we should watch tonight. Okay. I will leave you be. I'm gonna go make some popcorn. Now, do you want buttered? Or, like, extra buttered? Or... Maybe you're thinking like kettle corn. I am a personal fan of kettle corn. What do you think? You think we should have both? Okay, I think that's a very smart idea. I'm gonna go do that. I'm already so hungry. My belly is like crumbling just thinking about eating the popcorn. Okay, so I'll leave you be. You take some time to de-stress and... Bye, bestie. Thank you so much for letting me hang out with you.